Hey guys, you say here and yeah, today I'm gonna be showing you guys how I mastered Andrew Meta bridging or how you guys can learn how to Andrew Meta bridge like your boy. And yeah, if you're new here, then don't forget to subscribe because your boy is trying to hit the hundred key and drag click with the hundred key play button and we're really close to YouTube rank. And don't forget to drag click that like button because at two k likes I'll make a new new world overlay for Bed Wars. Oh, and don't forget to get my new Luna client bandana and my Luna client cloak. They're both linked in the description guys, just click on the link and yeah, it gives you more bridging power guys, that's how I mastered this bridge. Okay guys, so before we start, so I just start with the requirements or what I learned before uh, Android Meta Bridging. I can already drag click, I mean like come on guys, that's the fundamentals of bridging. And I learned how to go bridge in one hour, you guys can watch the video if you want, it should be in the description. How to go bridge in one hour and I learned how to moonwalk in one hour. That's also linked in the description guys, just click on the link in the description and watch it. And I can also breeze bridge, which I learned in 10 minutes cause come on guys, it's breeze bridging man, anybody can do it. And yeah, those are what I had to do before learning how to enter meta bridge. Okay guys, so first off let me just show you guys how Andrew meta bridging works. So what you guys first do is place a block below yourself. Let me just do the setup, there we go. So one block below yourself and then one block above yourself and you guys Sprint and jump to the edge of the block and then do report and repeat this the whole time. You can see one block below you, one block above you, sprint jump to the edge, repeat. So yeah, the reason why this is faster than telebridging and any other bridge is because you're faster in Minecraft if you jump and there's a block above you. So yeah guys, sounds pretty simple but it's harder than you <laughs> what you guys think. I mean like come on guys. How are you supposed to like react so fast? Like place a block below you, above you, jumps sprints. Like the aiming is a huge part here, because if you miss the block, if let's say you click here, then you just mess up the whole thing and you just fall down. Okay guys, let's just take a look at how Terminator does this, because he was the first person to make a video on this. Yeah, guys, this bridging method is kind of almost impossible, boys. Almost impossible, but we actually learned it. Let me just show you guys how I can do this. Oh, by the way, guys, don't be sad if you can't do this. I mean, very few people can do this. I'm pretty sure it's only like, I don't know, Teddy Nader and a few others who can actually do this, but they can't do this consistently. Like I can. Okay, guys, so what I do is I place one block below me, one block above me, and then I just do this. And yeah, as you guys can see, your boy's legit, no hacks. And yeah guys, look at how fast that was, man. Look at how fast this was. Okay, let's compare this with go bridging. And yeah, that's go bridging, guys. Okay, I probably can't see it right now, but you guys just saw the comparison. Like, look at how much faster Andrew Meta Bridging is, guys. Like, just jumping and sprinting. That's such a big difference. Like, guys, this is just too OP. Let me just turn on CPS so you guys can see my keystrokes. Okay, let's place one here. Up oh, there, there. And yeah, okay, guys, let's see how many CPS I, I need for this. Oh my god, guys, I can do this with zero CPS, guys. See, zero CPS clicking method. This is faster than my 0 CPS study, guys. Look at how fast this is. Oh my god, boys. Look at that distance, man. What? We could go, like, from one side of the map to the other. But no problem, boys. No problem at all. But jokes aside, you guys probably already noticed. This is my April Fool's joke. I mean, like, come on, guys. It's the 1st of April, so I had to do something to get you, to get you guys. Comment down below if I actually got you guys in the comments. And be honest. I don't know, my guys. Don't comment anything in the comments. Just be like, oh my god. Legit. Oh my god. Best bridge or anything. Because, come on, guys. We gotta, like, fool more people. So yeah, just be all like, oh my god, Andrew Meta Bridge OP, oh my god, how'd you do it? But like, come on guys, be a good sport about it. <laughs> oh no. But yeah guys, I don't think Andrew Meta Bridging is actually possible, because it's too fast, man, like, we are humans, man, there's no way anybody could react that fast. And I don't 
support the use of uh, bridging mods they could get you banned on servers guys never use this on servers i use this on single player because i don't want to get banned and yeah just don't use them guys never use bridging mods they, they'll get you banned and it's pretty obvious to see i mean like come on guys who moves like that while intermediate bridging there's no way so yeah never use bridging mods and yeah guys leave a like if i actually got you with this prank i want to see how many people can i get with this guys how many people can i get with this and yeah guys this is my first time using a bridging mod so i was kind of scared because yeah but again guys never use bridging mods i'm gonna delete this after this video never never use these guys they could get you banned from servers and you could get in trouble guys never use bridging mods never 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 learning how to do bridges is actually more fun too than instead of just getting a mod that does it for you i mean like come on guys look at how fun this is Instead of just pressing a button and then doing it. How is this fun, man? I'm not even doing anything. And yeah, guys, thanks, thank you for watching and thank you guys for being a good sport about it. And yeah, leave a like if I actually got you guys. I want to see how many people can I get with this.